Hey, I just have one question for us fathers this year. One simple question. Do you have goals set for this year? Do you have a mission set for this year for your family, for yourself? It's so critical and it's so important. Throughout the year, many times we have health goals, we have financial goals, but we don't have father goals. I always say this, there's no perfect father, there's no perfect man. But it's very important that we be engaged fathers or engaged men. And we have to understand that this year is the most critical time. Why? Like my coach is always saying college football. Why is this the most important game? Because it's the next game. Why is it the most important year? Because it's this year, 2023. And I want to ask you a simple question. Do you have goals for your family? Do you have goals for yourself as a father? Are you going to be more engaged? I know for me, I have to work on my tone. My kids can tell you my tone, my approach, when I'm uh, giving the right instructions or telling them to do something totally different. My upbringing is totally different than their upbringing. And we have to understand as fathers that we got to set some goals for ourselves as men, as dads. Because I, I, I like to say it like this. Many times I hear people say, you know, well, I'm not a father yet. I'm not a dad yet. You don't have to be a father to be a part of Father's University. But you may have to have to unlearn some things that you learned from your father or your mentor or, or, or men that was in your life. There are un, some unlearning. Many times when, when I tell my kids there's some things that, things that I have done or am doing, they, they have to unlearn. We always are in position to unlearn. But I want to ask you that simple question. Do you have goals as a father for this year for you and your family? Do you have a mission statement set? to push for greatness that's inside of you. I want to encourage you to set those goals, to set those goals. Many of us as men, we want the product, but we don't want the process. We want the product, but we want, don't want the process. And one thing I do thank God for being a former football player, that you learn about process. You learn about seasons, you learn about games, you learn about practice, you learn about weight room training because you can't win games if you don't put time in the process. And using this fitness goals and father's goals and health goals and finance goals, we have to get an understanding that there's nothing ever greater than knowing that your goals, the process, time, seasons, stick to itiveness builds to something greater. This is Emerson Morris coming from Fathers University, where we educate men in fatherhood, finance, and fitness. This is going to be a special year with curriculum and classes. This is going to be a special year with coaching that we have. This is going to be a special year because there's no father that's greater than you. Happy New Year.